Hi lovelies, welcome to Model Bites. For this episode, we're making one of my mama's seasonal favorites, eggnog French toast. Here's what you'll need. A cup of eggnog, nutmeg, I threw in a little cinnamon, butter, sliced, and of course, a loaf of French bread. Cut the bread into slices that are about one inch wide thick. They don't have to be exact because goodness knows I'm bad at eyeing measurements. So just make sure they're not too thick and not too thin. Once you've got a few pieces already sliced up and ready to go, you need to put them on a plate, set them aside so that we can get ready for the next part of the recipe. All right, here we go. Four beautiful pieces. Move this out the way. Ooh, my kitchen's about to get messy. All right, so you're gonna take a cup of your favorite eggnog, pour in our nutmeg, all pretty. Whisk that up, a little bit of cinnamon, battered up, ready to go. Let's take this over. Remember to preheat your grill. We're gonna melt a couple of tablespoons of butter. Ooh, look at that sizzle. Dipped the bread in the eggnog mixture. Ooh, Lord. Mmm, that eggnog's so good. <laughs> so make sure it's nice and soaked, like you're sopping up gravy. All right, now you're going to place this bad boy on the griddle. So just to let you know, this is gonna cook about two to four minutes on each side until it's nice and brown. Ooh, then place another piece on the griddle. Grab a plate. Here we go. This looks really good. All right, so we're almost ready to eat this French toast. First, we gotta sprinkle a little powdered sugar on it. Look at that. Yes. Yes, the more the merrier, definitely. Now, I don't know about you, but I like pecans. And some syrup. And we've also got this wonderful, everything but the kitchen sink frittata right here. Now for the real test. Let's see about this French toast. Mmm. 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 I know you're not supposed to talk in your mouth full, but I don't care right now. It's just so good. Okay. Thanks for chowing down with me. I'll see y'all next time.